Joanne, it's time to get up. Come on. If your children are four years old, they can make their own bed. But it has to be easy for them. Hi, I'm Pam Young. I'm Peggy Jones. We wrote the book on how to get organized called Sidetracked Home Executives. Tonight we have a good idea on how you can make a bedspread that will actually help your children make their bed. It used to be when we were disorganized that our kids would make their bed before dinner. Well, now we have a rule that before they get to have breakfast, they have to be dressed and their bed has to be made. And they usually have two problems with the bedspread. It's getting it on so that it's even and getting the pillow in right. Well, this bedspread solves that. What we did was buy two packages of bias tape and we sewed it right along the edge of the bedspread to correspond with the edge of the bed. You could get a ready-made bedspread and sew this bias tape along the same edge, but this was one piece of flat material and then a different color for the dust ruffle, and we sewed the bias tape across right along the edge of the seam. Now the other problem, the pillow problem, we solved that by sewing a little sleeper. This is a six-month size sleeper with one seam to the bedspread. And then we stuffed the legs with stuffing, and we sewed it so the stuffing wouldn't come out. Then we made a face and we applicate it on right where the pillow would be. Then, when you put the child puts the pillow down, if it's done right, the bunny's head comes down to the bunny's body. And then the child knows the bed's made right. Now the other problem is that they leave their pajamas out. Just unzip this little sleeper and put the pajamas inside, and then that keeps the sleepers always in the same place. And it gives the bunny a tummy. If you want their, your children's room clean and the bed made before breakfast, Make a simple bedspread like this and you'll take care of all those problems.